Don't miss the Giro d'Italia Big Start in Northern Ireland. Plan your big value Big Start break now. Discover NorthernIreland.com. The team and I have been working on Giro d'Italia for now over 12 months. Uh, some of the planning for this started in Naples with the, with the Giro d'Italia in 2013. So it's been a long process. You're putting 200 of the world's top cyclists into narrow roads and thousands of people watching them. So all of that proves uh, a challenge for making safety arrangements for the riders, the participants, the spectators and indeed the people working on the event. For cycling fans, it really is the chance of a lifetime. The opportunity to see some of the best riders in the world. It's a huge event to organise. Our own direct labour squads will be putting up 1,700 of these over the next 10 days. But this will be the biggest temporary traffic management scheme we've ever had to deal with in Northern Ireland. Belfast has the two race days and has a fantastic programme of activity, including events up in Stormont, including events down in Titanic Quarter. It is absolutely the best place to see the Giro d'Italia. Everyone has really pulled together in a partnership from ourselves, the tourist board, local councils, the police service, the road service, to make this the most successful event ever. The response has been tremendous, uh, whether you're a business in the Newton Arts Road or whether you're a community in North Antrim, um, putting all your sheep pink, uh, I think everybody has really entered into the spirit of it. We haven't had experience of the Giro in other foreign countries like Denmark and Holland at big starts. The Giro expect to see a lot of people embrace the pink, so to speak. People can dress their houses, their businesses, their gardens. Pink is the colour of the leader's jersey, so it has a big resonance for the Giro and uh, everybody should just embrace the pink in May. I think every shop, retail unit, bar, club, restaurant in Belfast should embrace it. Cracks mighty in Northern Ireland and they should come over and enjoy it. If you ever thought 10 years ago we'd have the Giro Italia come in three bush mills, just over a bit of decent weather and some pink fish. I think it will uh, transform Armagh, no doubt about that. The cycling outfits are colourful, you know, the whole cavalcade of cars with the bikes on top of them. It'll be like a carnival. Well, I think it'll make it a, a real festival weekend up here in the North Coast. And I hope they go away with great memories. I think Belfast better prepare itself, really, because it's not going to know what hit it. It's the world's greatest cycling race. Thousands of eager fans don their best pink garb and brave the rain as Belfast welcomed the Giro Italia to Northern Ireland. The Giro landed in Belfast on Thursday night with the official big start launch drawing a sold out crowd to welcome the teams taking part in this year's race. Some 22 teams from across Europe, the US and beyond were led onto the stage with the pomp and ceremony usually reserved for a large stadium concert. Almost 6,000 people packed into the grounds of City Hall with hundreds more gathered outside. And one of Northern Ireland's very own homegrown hopefuls, Nicholas Roche, said he was left speechless by the crowd's response tonight. Well, uh, first of all, thanks for everyone for being here tonight. I'm speechless. Uh, oh, I, mean, uh, I was expecting a warm welcome, but this is just uh, way beyond what I thought, so thanks again. Fellow Irishman Philip Dynan also took to the stage to welcome the crowd. See the day where I'll be able to start a grand tour in my own country, so, uh, so yeah, it's amazing. Over the next few days, more than 140,000 visitors are expected to descend on Northern Ireland. Friday kicks off three days of racing action across Belfast, Causeway Coast, Glens of Antrim, Armagh, before finishing off in Dublin on Sunday. John Mulgrew, Belfast Telegraph. Don't miss the Giro d'Italia Big Start in Northern Ireland. Plan your big value Big Start break now. Discover northernireland.com.